Welcome to DG in the morning, DG 360 here. We're talking French toe sticks with really the masters of taste. Uh, you know, these guys know all about tastes, different tastes, uh, and it's going to make me hungry. They're going to talk about the best French toast stick ever. I have to say Burger King was my solid go-to French toast stick. What are your favorite French toast sticks that are out there in the fast food genre realm if you're eating it still? Very unhealthy. I would say that Wendy's has stepped up considerably with their French toast sticks. If you have not tried a Wendy's French toast stick, you know, Wendy's kind of stepped up on their game. Yeah, Burger King and Sonic. Ooh, Sonic. Can't forget about the Sonic. The Sonic French Toast Stick. Very solid French Toast Stick, Coop. Coop, Coop knows what's up. You want to know about food, ask me and Coop. Coop. <laughs> yeah, Burger, King's a, a Burger King is a go-to, though. Burger King has always been, like, the go-to French Toast Stick. Anyway, let's see what French Toast Sticks they're going uh, to to review here. Burger King's got to be there. I think Wendy is a new kid on the block that, that needs to be presented here. Uh, I, I would be interested to see if the Sonic, the IHOP French Toast Sticks, Futz, Futz has a good point. The IHOP French Toast Sticks are pretty, pretty fire. Mm-hmm. Nocta says the Burger King near me is a bag of ass. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Some Burger Kings can be a literal bag of ass. You are right, Noctis. I will say that. Some Burger Kings are complete fails. Most Burger Kings lately have been complete fails. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Wendy's breakfast game. <sighs> Boy, there's a, it's so interesting that you say that, man. So, Wendy's breakfast game is so polarizing. People either love it or hate it, man. I will say the, the Wendy's French toast steak is pretty good, in my opinion. In my opinion. Okay, let's see. E-Red has none of this. E-Red... Poor e Brad living in Taiwan. We got to introduce American foods and make him gain at least 35 pounds. Um, <laughs> Wiki says the ones on the interstates are pretty bad. Anyway, let's see what the, what the guys think here. We're finding the best French toast stick. Let's talk about that. Mythical morning. Or should we say, bonjour, mythique. Yes, today we are channeling the sophistication of the French by eating the most highbrow food of all time. French toast sticks. Il est temps de zout alors. The French toast sticks are, how you say, bon. Okay, Loompa Oompas. Today, you're going to taste, guess, and ultimately choose the best French toast sticks from Burger King, Sonic, Wendy's, Carl's Jr. Carl's and as a Jr. little bonus, we're throwing in Eggo French toaster sticks and Eggos. I hop. Okay, we got a good presentation here, everybody. We got a good presentation of French toast sticks. <laughs> you got your Burger King, you got your Sonic, and your Wendy's. We all talked about those. And for Futs, we got our I hops there. He's he's working on the road every day. He's on that road driving them big rigs. So, you know, IHOP is definitely up there in the battle. This is going to be an interesting battle here. And all of these sticks will be served without syrup via the patent-pending French kiss. So go ahead and put your blindfolds on. Here we go. Here I don't know how go. much I need a blindfold because I've What's never up, had Kiera? any. Good morning. Yeah, how you doing? Um, but you know what? All brand. Okay, here, here we go sticks? with the Wendy's. Maybe we can queen sweep it. Well, as you can see, we can't, which means, yes, I'm ready. Let's do it. <laughs> I like oh, oh there it is. Man. <laughs> mm. We kind of have to, like, go off of the other items from this restaurant. You, like, extrapolate what they would make a French toast stick to be. Mm -hmm. And there's no syrup on that. They're all going to be dry. Uh, I think that's unfair. First off, let me just say, as a fast food connoisseur, I feel as if the syrup has to be there in order to complete the whole French toast stick experience. Just my advice. Um, and first, you're going to need to think of yeah. your yeah. Skit, your, your rating, one Gotta to ten rating. For each my score is the syrup can definitely change the view. Like, see, now I'm upset about this right from the get go because I feel like the entire reviews are going to be flawed. Syrup. 
And what the French toast stick does with the syrup is a completely graded genre. It's a whole tranche unto itself that enhances. It enhances. That's like watching these without me. That's like... That's like watching a video without me. Can you imagine just watching this without me? That would be terrible. I am an enhancer. I am the syrup to all of these videos. Do you understand? I am the literal syrup to the video. The syrup is so important. The syrup is one of the most important features to the French toast stick. The syrup or the enhancing element is one of the most important factors to not only your viewing experience, but your taste buds and what they're craving. You need that enhancement. God damn it. The French toast stick, you dip it in the syrup bucket. There are so many things that can happen. If it's too dry, it won't soak it up. If it's just the right consistency, it brings it in. It sucks it in. If you take that bite of that French toast stick, the syrup can just explode in your mouth in such a magical way that you can't believe the goodness, right? If you do not have that enhancement syrup, you are definitely in some serious trouble. Burnt. No, mine wasn't that bad. So on a <laughs> 1 in 10, what is oh, burnt? Oh, it's a little spicy, you? though. Spicy. <laughs> That's weird. Mine is not burnt. Spicy. Mine is not spicy. Something y'all did something to mine. Y'all gave me a poblano. Right. Like poutine without the gravy. Right, fingers. <laughs> Didn't you? I knew it. For years, I knew you were going to sneak in a poblano. And you finally did it. Hey, I actually do know what you're saying. That there's, it's a little spicy. I, I know. I, there is something in there, which is strange, right? Who would do a spicy? Exactly. And I think that... Exactly. They all kind of have are going to have this microwave vibe. This one definitely <laughs> yes, does. Yes, so. I'm going to give it this a my relationship with food. I'll give it a five. It's right down the middle. Uh, I'm it's starting to grow on me, and the more that I like let it di begin to digest a little bit. Six. Yeah. Okay. Pretty yeah, yes. I'd have gave it a six. Um, I'd yeah. have gave it a six. That's fair. Uh, Some spicy rubbed off of something else. That's my hint. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. To myself. Three. It kept it in the fryer basket. One. I Wendy's. Hop. You think I oh hop? Oh my I hop's goodness. I got to do better than that. Well, with I a don't French know, toast man. stick. Oh, is it internet? Oh my goodness. Look at look at this. Link is going to win. Link is Link is already on this shit. National House of Pancakes, it's not the International House of Prayer. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> you can't change your answer uh, now. Okay. Uh Kiera says, probably the cinnamon taste is spice. You know what it probably is, Kiera? They probably kept their fries or something spicy, like their spicy chicken. They probably had the oil from the spicy chicken from yesterday, and they put those French toast sticks in the spicy chicken oil. You see what I'm seeing, Kiera? So they got that spicy chicken on top of their French toast stick because they forgot to to put the new oil in. So they got the 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 yeah right 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 right. It's contaminated. It's a contaminated French toast stick coop. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, yuck. Can you believe what they do at these fast food places, Nikki? You got to go over and you got to manage them right now, Nikki. Go over and manage these people. You got tainted toast. You got tainted toast. You got spicy chicken on your French. Actually, chicken and chicken and French toast uh, with some syrup. I might, mean, I might, I might kind of like that actually. Now that I'm thinking about it, I might kind of like the spice. Uh -huh. <laughs> Je mange le French which, toast. Which one is this? Which one is this? Oh, what? What is this thing? This oh. is the egg. It yeah, is so it like small an and dejected. Yeah, that. <laughs> I knew this was going to happen with Ego. Chewy. Yeah. Flat. Yeah. This is definitely not a poblano. <laughs> yeah. It's very bready, but not eggy at all. Three. <laughs> not great. Yeah. 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 I also give this one a three. Yeah. Why, why is it so it's, it's, sad? Cause it's cause it's a fro it's a freezer food it's a freezer food. I think I know why. I have you a guess. Ready? Oh, well, what's the guess? Uh, I just think I know why it's sad. But you can't tell me. You Be think that will influence my guess? Yep. Yes. Yep. Yes. He knows. What, uh, well, Three, two, one. Eggo. Burger King. Woo! Now we got ourselves a tie. Now it's getting exciting. Now we got ourselves a tie right now. See, I no. thought that that tasted like something you put, you get out of a package. 
Ego's got to do better than that. Listen, listen, listen. This is why I always say bet with Rhett. We did. We didn't. I'm gonna go with this. We do this every time we watch a good mythical morning. We put our. We place our bets. One is for Rhett. Two is for Link. I'm going with my one. Rhett has some caveman taste bud abilities where it's just like his his flavor tastes are always dead on. So I got to bet with Rhett. I'm going to go with Rhett on this one. Every once in a while, Link will win. Link started out really strong. <laughs> Stink with Link, says Stutter. I'm, I'm <laughs> Do we have any twos here? Is anybody going with Link right now? Beards also enhance the flavor, Wookie. You are absolutely right. We got a two. Backspace is going to go with the link. Wow, look at Backspace going diamond in the rough mode. Diamond in the rough is saying two. I might change my answer. Backspace, I might change my answer. Man, Backspace Backspace usually is right about this. Usually Backspace gets this shit right. Uh, Nikki is abstaining. She is not quite sure yet. You got to put your bets in soon, though, Nikki. Can't keep, you know, probability-wise, you know what I mean? <laughs> you said that about IHOP too. I have high expectations of them both. Okay. Expectations. All right, here we go. Burger King. Another one. Burger Hi. King. I'll tell you what I like about the Burger King French toast stick right now. The burger, if done right, if done right, which these days, <laughs> good luck getting anything done right at a fast food joint. But when they do that French toast stick right at Burger King, and it's not like... <laughs> One of our members said a bag of ass. <laughs> Who said that? Who said that their Burger King was a bag of It was Noctis, I think. If you get a Burger King that is not a bag of ass and they know what they're doing. Yes, Noctis. <laughs> Noctis. If you get a Burger King that knows what they're doing and they cook the French toast stick right, I would say, I would say Burger King, hands down, would probably win because they got that moist. You know, a lot of people don't like that word, but just go with me on this one. They got like a moist mouth feel, okay? The texture of it. It feels French in your mouth, you understand? It's got that wonderful French mouth feel, which is why the best kissing is French kissing. You understand what I'm saying? Follow me here. Follow me here. The best kiss in the world is a French kiss. There's no other kiss better than a French kiss. That is why the French toe stick and the mouth feel is probably the number one category on why French toast stick is a French toast stick would be mouthfeel. Can I get an amen on that explanation? Yes, Can I get an amen? Yes. The French toast stick mouthfeel is right up there on the number one category and the reason why the French toast stick is a French toast stick. <laughs> oh, 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 good yes, gracious, that is crunchy. Oh, oh. Okay. All right. Wow. Mm. How did Set. it get so crunchy? It's crunchy. It's cinnamon. Yeah, the crunch, the crunch on the outside when they fry it right with that 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 delicious French mouth feel. Nee, nee, nee. This is decent. It's surprising. This tastes like real French toast. Like this tastes like just a slab of French toast. It's it could be a little bit. Yeah, got to have the Softer crunch on the, on the inside. It was kind of crunchy yeah, and soft. then chewy inside. Yeah, nothing else. Yeah, yeah. So I'm going to give go. it a seven. I like it. Yeah, yeah. I'll, give, I'll give it a solid I eight. Like I love it. Too. I think I'll I'm going to. give it a solid eight. Yeah, I, I'm going to give it a nice, generous seven as well. It almost has an eggnog sort of vibe to it, doesn't oh, it's it? Oh, is it festive? Is it that it's time of year a, again? It's a seasonal, <laughs> seasonal one. Know. It's a seasonal one. Hmm. I'm... I'm a bit torn. I'm trying to figure out, can they make something this crunchy at a fast food restaurant? You don't think they can get the crunch at a fast food? You already picked Burger King, so you can't. So this I, is going to be wrong, I don't wrong, expect it from a fast food place. Oh, can't pick Burger King again. That how you might guess that, so huh? he's, that's yeah, the but, wrong But it was one also Lincoln. small. I thought mine was pretty big. You did? Well, that helped. Link's going to guess IHOP because he can't guess Burger King again. So there's another wrong answer for Link. And Red is going to guess Burger King. So if you pick Link, you're in some serious trouble right now. Helps me. All right, I'm ready. That's what she said. Three, two, one. Carl Jr. Why do you say Carl oh. Jr.? Because they oh, make things wow. big. You remember that commercial oh, with the wrong. ladies and the they're big burger? Wrong. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yeah. It felt big to me. 
Oh, uh, you're going back to work, Nikki. See ya, hon. Have a really good day. Whip those employees into shape, manager, Nikki. You know the 2024 elections, they're right around the corner. They're going to be here before you know it. You need to be prepared. You need to register to vote. You need to figure out what's going to be on mm. your poll of that. Oh, oh, here we oh, go. Oh. Here we go. Which oh. one's this? Which we did it for you. Okay, here comes the IHOP oh, stick. Oh, here comes oh, the IHOP stick. Oh, now we got a big one. There's the IHOP. This is the one Fuzz That's likes. a big daddy. It's Let's... tall. It's fluffy. Oh, that is nice. Where's this one been? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. it's so square. Mm. It is a square, square stick. It's a square like stick. Like the cross section is a perfect square. It's spongy. There's a little it's hint spongy. of vanilla in there, I feel The vanilla like. is the part. Vanilla? Yeah, you know, yeah, the, the, the vanilla on the high hop stick is good. Futz is right about oh, the, this. For the longest time, the only way I would eat eggs was in French toast. Yeah. Because I didn't know not they were in lot, there. Not getting a lot of eggs that way, my friend. Mm-mm. I really appreciate the girth on this one. See, you said that Carl's Jr. goes big, and now you're experiencing big. So are you going to go Carl's Jr.? <laughs> I might. I, I'm not afraid to double up on a guess. You like that one, huh? You going to give it an eight? <laughs> well, here's the thing. He didn't let me finish. The girth, the texture is great, but the taste is lacking. That's what I thought. Six. Mm-hmm. Six for me, too. We're in agreement. We're both looking for the same thing in French toast, it seems. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's good. It's, it's bringing us together. It's the mouth feel, and yeah, you got to have a little bit of like some cinnamon almost with it, but you got to have the snap. See, IHOP doesn't have the snap. At least the IHOP sticks that I've had doesn't have that crunchy snap. Though we are competing, and only one of us can win. Uh, okay. Who is Three, it? Two, one. IHOP. Oh. The largeness Whoa. of it. Yeah, because they got plates there. You I mean, just put things on plates. They got so much more room. They got tables in the it's back. So big. Have you been in one of those? Yeah. A frame. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you got you use the height of the restaurant. Yeah, right. Oh, we got ourselves a game. <sighs> we don't think we've experienced Sonic. Here's the mm. Sonic. Oh. Oh. oh, here's the Sonic oh. stick. Sonic stick's got some game oh. too. Oh, that's a wide so, one. <laughs> yeah. Sonic Sonic's got some game on their French toe sticks for real. This is doing things for me in the taste region. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I really want to dip this one. Not that it's not good on its own, but it feels like... Good, good what, note. What do you like about it note. so much? Um, the flavor profile, which yeah. is yeah. French toast. Yep. yep. It tastes like mm -hmm. bread mm -hmm. that has been dipped in eggs <laughs> and got some cinnamon on it and cinnamon. then, you know, put into cinnamon. a pan. and It tastes like French toast. This is the best one. I'm going to give it an eight. Why don't any of them sprinkle some powder sugar up on that? I mean, we're talking about sugar here, the staple of America. Why Why are, do none of these have, like, powder sugar sprinkled on them literally in the box? All they got to do is have one of those, like, little sugar things. You just squeeze it. Just like a splash of powder sugar on that. Well, I don't ever see that on any of these sticks. I'm going to give it a nine. Woo, man, you're really pushing things. You're leaving so little room for anything to be better. It was very wide. It was Peace big out, Eric. Have a good day. Love you, bud. Mm. <clears throat> Which is not very wide. I, Eric's leaving us now. Eric's got to work. Everybody's working. Oh, my God. The, the work. Who's working? Like, seriously. Everybody say thanks to St. Eric because he's keeping the show alive. He's so generous. Last night he was dropping crazy amounts of, of of gifting last night. Bless you, Eric. Bless you, bless you, bless you. I'm literally nothing without you, St. Eric. <laughs> I'm I think I'm all over this one. Uh well hold on now. And I gotta maybe, make a shirt. Maybe, maybe I will be too. Let me see. What? It, I mean, I mean there's there's a thank you, Stunner. Thank you, Stunner. Look, look at this. Stunner pledging to the channel for St. Eric. That's how amazing St. Eric is. And, of course, St. Chris. Without St. Chris and St. Eric, I don't think I could do this. <laughs> so, bless, bless those two individuals. Thank you. Thank them for being saints of this channel and keeping us alive. It's a 3, 2, 1. So. Okay, all right. 3, 2, 1. Sonic! Sonic! Yeah. Oh, you know oh, about this? No. Oh, Backspace, you are looking good on your bet. You are looking good on your bet, Backspace. Link is starting to own this up. See what I said? Backspace always wins. Oh, but I know that Sonic has, like, different sandwiches that are to have toast. They have toasted 
sandwich that uses bread Ooh, I totally agree, toasted but bread. I, it's a sweet uh, Hawaiian I think bread. Mm. I, so I think that they've got their toast game down. That's my favorite kind of toast is the one with the bread. So right, Fudd. So right. Oh, whoa. Oh, we got some powdered sugar up on here. Who's is this? Who's is this? Carl's Jr.? What have I never heard of Carl's Jr.? Oh, who said it was a Hardee's in our area? Because it's Hardee's. Okay, who who said that? Who said that? On the final stick. There's the powder mm-hmm. sugar. There's okay. the powder oh, sugar. Cinnamon. And sugar. Oh. Whoa. And flavor. Boy, there you are you very Dang. emotive when it comes to this one. Should you put that much sugar on French toast sticks? Um, I mean. They did. if Because you're still going to dip it in the syrup. Yes, you should. You don't have this. to do it with this one. I'm missing one ingredient. Egg. <laughs> it it tastes more like a churro. It does taste like a churro. So I really liked it. But then when I'm really holding it up against the standard of French toast, I'm bringing it to an eight. I wanted to say nine, then I brought it to an eight. I like it for a churro, but I'm going to give it a four. Ah. Oh. What? Yep, because it doesn't represent it doesn't represent French toast is probably why Link is saying that. It doesn't re- represent the standards of French toast. It's not French toast. I, get uh, it. I wouldn't have I known. Get it. I get it. If I weren't doing this already. All right. Brink, brink, brink. You got a guess? No. Gosh, where's this from? Hmm. Who would go so far afield? I mean, I would guess Taco Bell if I could. <sighs> I have a guess. Okay. Three, two, one. Sonic. Wendy's. Sonic. Sonic. Did Link you? just win this one? Did Link just Never. win this one? You don't think? You see, you feel like you know a lot about Sonic. Yep, I do. I'm one of the guys in the Sonic commercial. Oh, you're one of those. Mm-hmm. Huh. All right. Okay. How are you feeling about <laughs> how you did across the board? I could have gotten zero, and I wouldn't be surprised. It's a crapshoot, which also uh, can barely see. is a good idea for another episode. Okay. Well. By far, your favorite French toast sticks were from Sonic. That's where you you heaved the most praise. Yes. Wow. Sonic. Did you Look guess Sonic that really? Which Look means that Sonic was not Sonic's the last Sonic's Burger King, correct. number two. You got... Yes, I did. Two, correct? Whoa. I'm wow. surprised. And Link, you got three, correct? Wow. Oh, my God. Backspace pulls the win up on this one. Amazing. Link actually won one and Backspace picked it. I'm going with Backspace. From now on on these, I got to go with Backspace. Oh, yes. Which That's means crazy. you are our wee wee wow. winner. <laughs> and uh, every wow. time you say, am I right? In Good Mythical More, the entire Mythical crew has to say wee wee. So what was our least favorite? I think it was uh, Wendy's. It was Ago. Oh, which Ago. Okay. Rhett got I correct got right. because, yeah. yeah, you said it's it's puny. And did and we then, like IHOP? Um, the, the next one after that, you liked the least. The first one that you thought was spicy, that was from Wendy's. So Link got that correct. But How did you that's get the that? Next How did you, you think like Wendy's would make it spicy? Because they have a spicy sandwich. They, 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 somebody- there you go. There you go. That's exactly what I was saying. They got mixed it There's up. There's like ghost pepper floating around in that place. Right. Okay, right, there you have right. it. <laughs> Get yourself some Sonic, y'all. Thanks for subscribing and clicking the bell. You know what time it is. <laughs> I am right. Listen, listen, listen. I'm telling you what. We are all connoisseurs of, of taste. Good Mythical Morning. Love the show. If you don't know it, go there. They've been doing this forever. Always entertaining and always much more entertaining while watching here on DG360. Because we enhance. We enhance like syrup to a French toast stick. I am like a giant syrup bucket. Dip yourself in me. That's That that wasn't good, Felix. You're looking at me strange. I, okay, Pepe usually just yells at me. You're just kind of looking at me. Okay, don't look at me like that. All right, Felix. All right, that's enough. 